welcome to that time of the week. We are preview, or not previewing, we are reviewing the first week of finals footy in the world of rugby league. Um, from memory, I'm pretty sure I got all my tips right. Four from four, uh, four, 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 four from four. Tongue twister. Ugh. Um, but yeah, pretty much how I saw the round coming. Um, Sharks eliminated, Knights eliminated, uh, not surprisingly there. Um, so yeah, let's, let's just crack into the games, shall we? First game we had was Raiders, oh, was that the first? No, first game was Panthers v Roosters. Panthers v Roosters. Let's just fix this up over here. That's all good. Uh, 29 to 28. I was keeping up to up to tabs on this game, and it was, I want to say it was like 24 or 20, 20 or 24 to, I want to say 10 at one point um, when I was tuning in. Uh, did not think Roosters would be able to come back so close. Luckily, uh, Cleary kicked a field goal when he did. Um, but yeah. It was good. It would have been a good game. I didn't really watch any of the rugby league games because I was too busy watching the other sport. Um, so sorry to all the rugby league fans out there. But, yeah, I can't really say much on um, the NRL games. But I know Cleary got, I think it was 21 points he scored out of the whole game. Uh, well, let's see. Two, yeah, did, yeah that, that adds up. 21 points. Um, so... If he doesn't win, um, maybe even Golden Boot as well as um, Daily M, uh, I'd be very, very surprised. Um, even that whole fiasco with the whole COVID thing at the beginning of the year, he's played, he's just led the Panthers from the front, um, which we kind of all see, see uh, kind of all saw happening, uh, I think, two years ago. Um, we knew he was a star. Uh, it's just, yeah. Even with that, yeah, I won't go there. Um, ugh, fluff. Second game, we had Raiders take on the Sharks. Raiders winning 32-20. to Oh, actually, I should say that that first game, it was 29-28. to So, very close. It was very close indeed. Uh, Raiders versus Sharks, 32-20. to uh, It's very hard to take on Canberra in Canberra, so good luck to anyone who takes takes them on. Um, I saw Jack White and got man of the match for that game, so that doesn't really surprise me. He always plays good. He's one of their better players in the in the team. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, so yeah, no no surprises there. Uh, that's that's all I can say. Like I said, I didn't really watch any games. I did kind of watch some highlights. Uh, we'll move on. So that tips two to two. If if you saw my tipping last week, then you can correct me if I was wrong. Anyway, um, Storm 30, 36 to twenty four against the Eels. Uh, no surprises. I'm actually, I, I want to say I am surprised that that the Eels actually managed to score the first two tries. But it doesn't surprise me that they ended up losing because they have had a very up and down season. We're very lucky to stay in the top four, in my opinion. Um, yeah, pro helps when you've got Gutherson out there, who's just he's just a machine this year. Uh, so yeah, Cameron Smith is just six from six goals. So well done to you, sir. Uh, and then our last game for the week, not surprising, 46 to 20. I was, I think I watched the last 10 minutes or something of this game, and it was just try after try after try. It was like, damn, poor Knights. Um, they ended up just getting smashed. Adam Reynolds kicking. Ooh. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. Okay, he's either got... I don't know, he would have kicked f maybe five from six. Maybe? I don't know. Maybe five from seven. Uh, who knows? But, yeah. 
usual spot that bleh, we'll get there usual suspects and try scoring cody walker johnston murray cook who um had a great actually it was a pretty good try by him for a little fella um so yeah that is all my tips four from four if i recall correctly so so yeah i will see you later in the week for my other tips which will be for week two of the finals ciao ciao Feel uninvited Left home in West LA I'm not excited